Today is Monday, the 24th, or I'm sorry, it's 25th of March. Wow, I can't remember. Today, and today we're going to talk, I'm talking a little bit about complaining. You know, I, I hear a lot of people complaining. I see on Facebook people complaining about one thing or another, whether it's, whether it's their work, their boss, um, some one of their friends, or the, the president, or the government in general, or whatever it is. And, and I always see this people, <clears throat> people complaining, and it really kind of bothers me. And the thing that really bothers me, <clears throat> I think is... Excuse me, I think it's great to complain. I think it's great to have an opinion. I think you should have that, be able to do that. But that's kind of worthless unless you have a solution or something that you can do. You have a plan to do something about it. It's kind of like a, it's kind of like a habit. You know, you, you say you've got a bad habit. You, you do something you, um, you shouldn't do. You waste a lot of time. You don't manage your time well. You go, well, I'm going to get rid of that habit. Well, you've got to, if you get rid of that habit and you say, yeah, that's a bad habit. I'm going to get rid of it. You've got to replace it because just like when you complain about something, it doesn't do any good just to talk about it. You've got to do something about it and, and make it make a difference. And a lot of people are scared to complain because, well, no, they're not scared to complain, but they're apprehensive because they say, well, gee, I, don't, I want to talk about it, but I don't want to do anything about it. Well, yeah, that's the problem. That's why we, that's why nothing gets done. That's why it's all talk and nothing done. If you're going to talk about it, before you complain about something, have some type of a plan that you know will work to take care of this, this situation, that you can do something about it, that you're not just blowing air, that you're actually going to do something about it. I um, I was in a video presentation over the weekend, and, and gosh, I, I was really disappointed in the way the whole thing was presented. The content was great, but the presentation was, was really poor. And... Uh, all weekend long, I'm thinking, well, I should talk to the people about that. And I thought, well, I don't know, you know, unless I have a great solution for it. And then they might not take it the right way. They might just think I'm complaining because that's what people do. And they might not be ready to implement a change. You know, we've got to be able to, we've got to be ready to make change if it's change is good. If it's, if it's a continuous improvement, if it's something that we want to make sure it doesn't happen the next time, then we've got to be willing to make the change. So next time, <clears throat> next time you feel like complaining about something, think about wh what are you going to do about it. <clears throat> if you don't like the current president, fine. Find somebody else. Find the right person. Support them. Don't just complain about the, the, the one that you don't like. Do something positive for the one that you do like. And that's the same way it is in business with anything you do. You know, don't complain about a certain process. Figure out a new process that might work better and promote that. Spend your time promoting the new instead of putting down the old. That's what we need. That, if you do that, you'll be a lot happier, you'll have a lot less stress, and you'll get a lot more things done. And have a great day, have a great week, and I'll talk to you next Monday.